Previously on Evil Touch. Well, why don't we start from the beginning? All right, kids, welcome to the Republic of Armenia. My name is Salazar. She's Daniel. Hey, did you burn yourself? Oh, no, I, it's this mark I've had since, since I was a kid. So we hear this moaning and this pleading. Rick, stop, Rick! They got really interested in Rick's passport. Rick? It was Rick. We have to get out of here. Now. Karen, are you ready? Okay. So we're supposed to just tunnel our way under the wall, Rick? I found a way to get us out by going over the wall instead of through the gate. There are guards everywhere. We can't use the street. No! No! This village is unique. We make enormous sacrifice. Bye, Sarah. No! I could hear Houston screaming. No! 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 God, no, so God, no, So I ran along the wall and Rick was following me. I was so terrified. No. And then it got crazy. Then it got crazy? Rick's eyes turned white and he collapsed. And the guards stood up and ran away like they were coming after him. And then this guy jumps off the wall and lands on his back. I mean, he should have been dead or paralyzed, but he just ran off like nothing happened. Come here! Come here! I saw they were taking Rick away, so I followed. They took him to this old building, like their headquarters. And Rick looked really messed up. In what way? I don't know, like, like drunk or stoned. Just really messed up. What, what's going on? Where are you taking us? Hey! Good night, good Pando, go! Don't touch it with that! Seriously, do not touch it with that! I 
swear to God, by, by any means necessary, I will find a way to have you prosecuted for killing Sarah. Your student, we're trying to escape. That's why you killed her? This one who killed girl. What are you, crazy? Rick would never kill anybody. That's because it wasn't him. What are you talking about? This, you're saying she did it, you're saying he didn't. I mean, get off me, get off I'll me. Take, I'll take Rick, what happened? It's not as it seems. Jesus. What did you do to him? Professor Miller, whatever you think happened, it's not as it appears. Not as it appears? This is ridiculous. I'm gonna have my friends at the embassy come here. Lisa, and, don't, and, stop talking. Listen, nobody's happy for this. If you stop talking, go listen. I tell you something, but you need to know. Why don't you go ahead and tell me then? Gevork, in che parte hai nella head? Cameron? Va te quando? Nella anche in martigel. Io mi hai nipra. Vorrei mandare a Maie che vorrà zate non sai l'ognia. Sono solo un termazzo lei, sai? Sono americano signori head. Na i vande. Io vuni il dega mi giochi carica. Io vna diva harce tu dal love kites. Հացեք, դուրս բերեք մարմիները և տարեք այրեք, հենց իմա։ You, go. You go out. Come. Finally, Melik comes back and I guess she convinced him to let me out. How? I don't know. They weren't speaking English, but uh, she had my inhaler with her, so I could finally breathe again. And you need to eat. I, I take to your friends. Okay, come. Go ahead, I'm listening. Have you in your studies ever come across something called charboki? No, what's that? What's your book? How about Pazusu or Shedu or Galu? Oh, okay, I get it. <coughs> you're talking about some benevolent supernatural entity, right? That's from the ancient cultures? Is that what you're talking about? Yes. What does that have to do with what's going on today? Charvoki is an ancient demon. It's an evil spirit. It has existed since man first walked the earth. It's one of the most destructive forces ever. It resides here in Tandim. It's our sacred duty to keep this evil spirit from escaping. What about this evil spirit? What does that have to do with anything? Charoki can possess anyone. It passes from person to person, through touch, skin to skin. And when people possessed, it's impossible to know because they act normal. Normal? There's nothing normal about any of this. You know what? Both of you are out of your freaking minds. Look, Professor, the only way to tell is the mark left on the skin when the demon leaves the host and moves to the next body. This looks like a burn. This looks like he's been branded. Maybe it's an allergic reaction. I think you know it is not. So now I'm just trying to keep from getting caught. And the guards are everywhere. And I'm scared. Vorrebbe marmin che te lo debbi come hai rumore sano di chapez. Ascolta, non so dire che il vorrebbe che ci hai tenuto. Ma ha cercato di battere Spahir, di zaccare il padre a starvati. Che non si inca. Karen! Oh my 
my god, what happened? Where the hell have you been? Rick said you were careful. Rick said you were dead, and then Malik came to get your inhaler and said you were okay, but had a virus or Wait, something. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. You saw Rick? Yeah. What? Yeah. It, it was really messed up. What? Oh, uh, Sarah, she's. Oh she's, my god. She, oh my god. Dude. She didn't make it. Why, why is this happening? Like, what happened? Everyone was out looking for you all night long, and then Rick came here, said you were dead, and he wanted us to go with him. This is just such a mess. Where even were you? Like, where have you been? I, 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 I don't even know where to begin. Well, start somewhere. Well, we like ran into this dungeon place, and there was this old man, and then I. I don't know, I must have got knocked out because I woke up in this pit and Rick wasn't in there, but the old man was, but he was dead. And then and then this guard, he was in there with me and he got speared to death. And I thought I was gonna get speared to death, but then the whistle blew. What? I know. Houston. Oh, buddy. Yeah, poor Houston. He was completely shattered. Why did they have you all in the canteen? I, I mean, I, I guess they realized that Rick had discovered the secret passage out of the stable and thought that was the safest place to keep us. You guys really believe the stuff you're telling me? Seriously? It's not belief. It is fact. I saw what it can do in my own eyes. It was inside in my grandfather nearly 50 years <laughs> till last night. It escaped, and it's not only us that are in danger. It's the entire human race. We need to find it and lock it up before it gets out of Tanran. Assuming what you're saying is true, which I don't know. I don't know. What's gonna happen to this boy? Is he gonna be all right? It's hard to say, Professor. Possession affects different people differently. Your student is one of the few to survive. He needs time to recover. <sighs> he needs to see someone. He needs to see a doctor. There is something very different this time. In the past, Demon comes wild and killed half the village. He's right. There is something different this time. You've seen this thing get out before? No. But it's all been recorded by my predecessors. And if this boy is the only one to survive, maybe he can tell us something. Something new? She's right. She's right. Maybe he knows something which can help us find the demon or fight it. Rick, can you talk to us? Young men, what do you remember? I remember. I remember. Yes? I 
remember. What? What? Everything. What the Charvo key? The demon. What it wants? It what? What? It what? Her. Co jsem věřil třicík? Třicík. Zapříčí ten čova, pak to asi. Ura. Balot. Žolde. Jsi kartu mezi pět kartu desítky. Nic. Սակայն ես կարծում եմ, որ կարելի էր այս ամենիս խուսապել, եթե հարկե չլին մեր սանասարի կտրուկ որոշումներ կայացնելու թուլությունը։ Նա կործրել է իր զգոնությունը, չապազանց թույլ է խեկավարելու համությունը։ Մ And then all of a sudden, Professor Miller shows up, and there he is. And Houston went crazy. What the hell happened to him? No. Are you okay? Look, look, look. You bastard! Houston, no! Houston, no, 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 no! You killed no. Sarah! It wasn't him! What is wrong with you? What are you talking about? I watched him do it! It wasn't him. He wasn't himself, man. What do you mean? What the hell happened, Professor? I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now. There's some kind of virus or an energy field. And then they tell me the demon took over Rick and that's what was controlling him. And now they're saying it left him and it's in somebody else. What, seriously, are you insane? I know it sounds crazy, but Rick just experienced something terrible. You know what? Rick has been a pig this entire trip. And now he finally lived up to being the murdering son of a bitch everyone knew he would be. And you what, you, you expect us to believe he's possessed by some demon? That's stupid. It's true. What? This is all true. We here in town room know it's to be. <laughs> Perfect, she's in on it too. Well, if it's true, then how do we know that he's not still possessed? It's okay, I'm not going to hurt you. This mark, this is what's behind after the spirit leaves the body and possesses someone else. So this thing that's possessing Rick is just in somebody else now? Hold on a second. Possession? Really? I mean, who do you think we are? I know it sounds crazy. We all thought the same thing. But... But what? But I'm not making this stuff up. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. The old man that was in that pit, he was possessed, and when he grabbed Rick's arm, that possessed him. Rick, is any of this crap true? Oh, my God. I want to go home. Something like, what, like... Where is this thing now? I'm like, what are they gonna do about it? 
He can be anywhere and any person. Professor, what are we going to do? How are we going to get home? Vicky, I don't know. I'm sorry. Look, I've only read about stuff like this in books. I know we got to get out of here. We got to get him some medical attention. Guys, where's Karen? Last time I seen her, she was on the wall with Dean boy. Ah. All right, listen. We're gonna get through this, and we're gonna get through this together, okay? First, you guys have to eat, especially Cameron, Rick. You guys look terrible, all right? Uh, we need to get you some food, uh, Miss? Malik. Malik, could you help? Yes, of course, I get food. Thank you. Listen, we are all leaving together, okay? I'm gonna go look for Karen, stay here. What, do we have a choice? I mean, we're held like prisoners in here. It is for your protection. Guys, it's probably the safest place to be right now. You shouldn't go out. Too dangerous. I guess you're right. through the village and I see these two guards fighting. One of them was the guy that Rick grabbed and jumped off the wall. And the other one, I didn't know. And it looked like they were trying to kill each other. saw me, so I ran. sort of like a vision. It was like, I could see where this guard was going and he was coming for me. And then he was there. Well, what happened? I held my breath and I hid and eventually he went away. There is a one other way out. What is it? It is back door to the canteen that is usually locked, and they would not have a guard. I will check. Follow me. OK. I can't lose another one of my students. I could be making a big mistake letting you out there. Thank you. I got to find this girl. Professor, please be careful. I don't know what happened if something happens to you. I'll be careful. Guys, once we're all together, we're getting out of here. Uh, so the professor, he leaves out this back door to go find Karen somehow, leaving us all alone in this canteen. And then Melek comes back in and locks the back door. What we didn't realize at that point was that there was this internal power struggle going on between the leaders of the village between Xanazar and his people on one side, and Zozip and his men on the other. Hi, Esther. Esther. I don't know what to say, Esther. Yes, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I'm going to go to the house. 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 
կարծում եմ որ այնտեղ է ունեցել կամուշ 3 օյան կամ էլ վաղ առավոտյան ուստի կարծում եմ որ դա այն ամերիկացին է որ դևին բաց թողեց ահա թե ինչ էր այն տեղի ունենում երբ ճիշտ քայլեր չեն ձեռնարկվում հետ ինչ նկատի ունես այն ինչ արդեն ասացի հիմա վաղուց հարցեր լուծած կլինենք ոնց Ես ինչ ինչ կան էի հետ իմ տեղին էի Ես ինչ կան էի հա դու նախ եւ առաջ ամերիկացիներից կձերբազարդվեի Դե ոնց նրանք ճապից ավելին են տեսել ճապից ավելին գիտեն Հետո այդ ամերիկացիները դրանցից ոչ մի օկուտ չկա այդ օտարականները նրանց պատճառով են մենք այս իրավիճակում հայտնվել նրանք բերեցին ողջ նող կանքը ոչ մի այն մեր գլխին այլ նաև ողջ մարդկության իրանց պետք է այստեղ պահենք ապահով եւ աչքի տակ մենք չգիտենք դեվը ու մեջ է հիմա այդ ամերիկացիները ողջ լինելու դեպքում մենք ավելի շահավետ ենք եւ հետո մենք կոչված չենք մարդ սպանելու ոչ հիմա ոչ էլ երբ եվ են մենք ուրիշ շարակելություն ունենք հասկացար ես քեզ հարց տվեցի հասկացար հասկացա դեր ուրեմն անցի քոպարտականություններ թել ինչ որ բան ունես ասելու չունեմ դեր ուրեմն ազատ ես իսկ ամերիկացիներով ես կզբաղվեմ ձե ամերիկացիներ ինչ որ բան կարողանան մեզ հաղորդել վերջի վերջո իրանք են առաջին առնչ վետի վահարի հետ հա այդ լավ միտքն է պետք է գնալ ամերիկացիների մոտ հասկանալ հասկանալ թե նրանք ինչ գիտեն somehow knew where i was supposed to go how was that i don't know like instinct instinct and where did this instinct take you i went down an alleyway and i saw this door that looked like it was unlocked and i thought it might lead me somewhere so i tried to open it but it wouldn't budge So I tried to figure out what to do next. And then the door just opened. By itself. And so I went in and I found myself in this dark hallway and I just had to see where it led. I came upon some stairs. So I went down the stairs. Something was drawing me down there. Are you sure you're not hungry? I I really think you should eat something. I'm not in the mood. I can't imagine what that was like. Hell. It was like being alive and being in hell at the same time. I killed Sarah. No, 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 it wasn't you, Rick. It wasn't me. I saw the whole thing through a mask. I felt evil. It felt good. And I liked it. 
Chúa nói hết Nó hỏi để tôi sợi Ây dối Bà hãy khởi Chúa sẽ kiếm Xin Mình thổ hỏi ở đây Ở đây Greg looked awful. He looked like hell. And that's exactly how he described what happened to him. At this point, I actually started to feel sorry for him. For Rick. <laughs> oh, Rick. He must have been a nightmare. I could use one of those vodka drinks. Are you sure that's a good idea? Honestly, I don't, I don't think it's a bad idea. I might take the edge off. Does anybody else want a drink? Yeah, I'll take one. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I have to tell her parents. And what are we gonna do about him? Get him arrested? Do I have to kill myself? I mean, this is just horrible, but... I mean, I know you're kidding about killing Rick, right? Right? You actually buy into this possession crap? Trying to get yourself killed? I told you I have to find my students. I have to make sure my kids are safe. Your own safety has a risk. Come on, come, come, come. Zanazar told Professor Miller the story about the guy who ran in front of the bus and what made him run. And, uh, it turns out it was the old man who grabbed Rick. Ah! Ah! A lot of people looking for around the village, the possessed guard. It's not safe for you to be roaming the streets. Listen, I have one missing student. I have one with serious health issues that I need to get to the hospital. You, need you to know that to is not possible at this time. Why is that not possible? We're not a threat to you. We're not a threat to your men. Listen to me. We don't know what is the greater purpose of the Charvoki is. Just that it's want to get out. Until he's not locked up, no one, no one can leave or enter the village. But what, what are we supposed to do? Do you even have a plan? <laughs> you are an educated man. And I know from your work, you don't believe in fate. I don't believe in fate, and I definitely don't believe in the supernatural. And yet, here you are. What do you think, that by luck, you are here a day when the Charvoki has escaped? What are you trying to say? You saying I had something to do with this? Not you personally. My students, then? I don't know. Listen, we were on the road when your man stepped in front of our bus. That's also Zonavor. Yesterday, something woke the demon. And I believe that Zonavor saw that, and that's why he ran. I don't know about your story, okay? But the one thing that I do know is the most dangerous and violent people always say they're on a mission from God. Professor Miller, what the people of Tamzin do is selfless and noble, keeping the world Save from evil. All right, all right, all right. I think you've had enough of that stuff, dude. <laughs> He's had enough? I think I've had enough. Him. Oh, my God. Houston. What? He's a piece of trash. And to tell you the truth, I'm sick of the sight of him. Whoa, dude, you need to relax. How much of that stuff have you had? Well, they both had too much to drink, and then it got ugly. No, dude, don't you see what this loser is doing? Acting like he's been possessed by some demon so he can literally get away with murder? Houston! Seriously? Are you really gonna go there? Why would Rick do that? You don't think I know you messed around with Sarah in Istanbul? No! Sarah's not hey. questioned in here! 
You stop this now or I will knock your heads in myself. And no more Chuchovka. You are acting like idiots. <laughs> All right, Sanasar. Can this can this thing be killed? Can it be destroyed? No, we don't think so. So then, why why do you men carry spears? What's the purpose? Spears used against the demon, against the people possessed by it. Mm -hmm. You may see those steel types. It's made steel with vahagnium. Vahagnium? Yes. I don't know what that is. It's rare and. Unique metal is discovered centuries ago. Wagner cannot kill the Sharvoki, but can hurt it and slow it down. Otherwise, people possessed it can be shot, stopped, and burned, and nothing happens. Mm. With Wagner steel, they can slow it down and lock it up in the keep. The bars are made with the same metal. Okay, so then why do you burn the bodies of the dead? just to make sure. Inside. It's not worth it. Houston, please. It was such a mess. I, I really don't know what Houston was trying to do. He just kind of lost it. And we were all outside, except for um, Kevin and Lainey and Rick. But then Lainey came outside. I went down further, and I had no idea where I was going. visions where I could see the guard was chasing me. But this time he was headed to the canteen. And something really bad was about to happen there. I had to get there. Thank you now. Come back inside, it's not worth it. No, everything is just so screwed up, I'm just, I can't. Houston, please. Yeah, come on, dude. Hey, Houston, you no, 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 Next time on Evil Touch. Professor, what are we gonna do? We need to get out of here. Oh, well, how? Stop, Stop it! What are you doing, man? Are you trying to get yourself killed? Houston, this is crazy! This is crazy? This whole place is crazy! I like to think that science can explain this phenomenon. What do you think? The world is only that what you can see, touch, or measure? Believe me, there is more. And some of is very, very bad. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> my